Hey, what's up, y'all? Hey, I was gonna do a, uh, another grilling video. I'm out here working on some fire pit grills right now that I gotta get done. I'm behind on schedule on them. And I'm out here working on those. And I was gonna cook on one of these tabletop grills that I build. And let's check it out. And we're just gonna cook some chicken legs and some uh, shish kebabs. And uh, I ain't gonna cook a whole lot of it. Because like I say, like I said before, it's really just me and my old lady eating. My son don't like chicken hardly at all unless it's chicken nuggets. You know how that goes. But anyway, this is the grill we're going to use. This is one of the 24-inch uh, tabletops I built. This is built out of 3 16 plate. They cook real good. That's the vent over there. That sucker's heavy, though. That's those fire. If y'all hadn't seen my other channel, that's the fire pit grills I built. I got that one. Another one going over there. And another one going back there. I got to get nine of them built. But anyway, what we're going to do is cook up this bag of chicken legs first. And I'm this time I'm using uh, Tony Chasseries marinade on them. And it's been in there, it's been marinating about 10 hours, I guess. And this is a pretty good marinade. And uh, what we're going to do, we're going to season them with Tony's. And it's been marinating in Tony's. If y'all ain't familiar with that, it's just a, a, Creole a Creole seasoning and marinade. A lot of people use it down here. But most people know what it is but anyway we're gonna get those seasoned up and put them on the grill let those cook and then get some shish kebabs put together I like to keep the big bottle of Tony's around here And that's a good seasoning for just about anything. If you like it. It's got a little spice to it. They got some that's a little hotter. I like to get plenty on there. You lose a lot of that seasoning in the cooking. Flipping it and all this and that. So I like to get plenty on there. So let's get that on. Alright y'all, that chicken's getting close to done. So I'm going to set these shish kebabs up. And what I got, this is just some sirloin steak cube down. And I put it in some of the, in what I had left of this marinade. This is a chicken marinade, but I only had a little left. So I said I'm going to throw it in there too. See how it comes out. And then this is just some Carolina Pride smoked sausage, pork and turkey sausage. It's just a cheap sausage, but it's a good one. I like this sausage. I'm going to cut it down in slices. And then just like with the chicken, I'm going to put some Tony's on that too, even on the sausage. I know a lot of people won't season their sausage, they just let it go because it already has seasoning in it when it's made. But I'm going to put a little bit on there. Then it's just going to be some onions and bell pepper. So all together we'll have steak sausage, onions, and bell pepper on there. So I'm going to go ahead and get these things set up and get them on the grill and get the sauce ready to put on that chicken. Alright, this chicken's about done until I'm ready to sauce it. 
which is going to be right after I get these kebabs on it. So I'm going to move it over to the cooler side of the grill and make room for these kebabs. And then we'll sauce these up and set them back on there. couple little pieces of steak left might as well stick it on and the rest of this onion because I like grilled onion all right we'll let those cook up I'm gonna get the sauce ready for the wings and we'll put that sauce on all right y'all on this sauce I'm just gonna go with some sweet baby rays Put me some in a bowl. <coughs> and mix that in with some sriracha. To give it a little heat. Mix it all up good. I like to put this sauce in a bowl. And then put the wings into the bowl. That way I can just mix them all up. Take them back out. Put them on the grill. And let that sauce bake into it. With something as small as a wing, it's just easier to do that way than trying to brush it on there. So that'll be the sauce. I'm going to put the wings into the sauce, mix it all up, put them back on the grill while those kebabs are cooking, and they'll be done. Everything's pretty much done. I just rolled those kebabs over a quarter inch or so at a time until they were all done. And that sauce has been baking on the chicken for about 10 to 15 minutes. So there you have it, chicken wings and steak and sausage kebabs on the little tabletop grill. I'm going to do another version of this grill soon where it's in a stand and on wheels and everything. This, this style is really built for people that like to go tailgate and take it to the lake, this and that. It's a good idea too to always scrape that rack off while it's still hot. So anyway, that'll wrap this video up. We put Tony's all around on it. Tony's marinade and Tony's seasoning. And that'll make you a good meal. So y'all come on back for the next one, man. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. And come back see what we're cooking next time.